commonplace where the common man is. It seems to me like they forget where they come from. They're no, 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 they're no longer us. It seems like it's so obvious to us to see what's going on in this country on a daily basis. From any uh, a number of different things that are going on, whether it be uh, immigration, whether it be BC, BTC, for instance, I have yet to hear, you know, um, Mr. Ingram was in power a few Let's years ago. Let's go, buddy. You're on top of things. I hear somebody from your side of the aisle say that Mr. Ingram was wrong for something he did. Or I have yet to hear one of the PLP say Mr. Christie was wrong about this or whatever, or we made a mistake or whatever it is. I mean, it's like you guys just, like, got no repentance for you. You know, it's like, um, like... No repentance. Mr. Ingram did or Mr. Christie did from the other side of both sides, like... Everything they did was right. They never did no wrong. No one could do no wrong. But yet, the country is bankrupt. Now, this is somebody who voted for Ms. Hunt, the FN, the FNM Ms. Hunt, in the last election, 7th of May, 2012. We're going to divest it. Why divest it to third parties when you could divest it to the, to the people that benefits the most? Huh? Cell Beach, B, B, C, the General Electric, which is the world's leader in power generation. Why are we allowing corrupt politicians to corrupt our situation so some people can make a lot of money from fossil fuel? Yeah. Corrupt corruption. Huh? Let's come platinum, man, and stop joking. You, you sound like you want a Heather Hunt as a new free national movement senator. Steve, to is, Steve uh, and to raised the issue. The people must keep an eye on Steve McKinney. Because he, 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 what he does, he's very skilled in knowing the issues that the people are uh, interesting, interested in the most. Now, what he's doing, in my humble opinion, is preying on the people's emotion. So his, his radio or hard copy show, in my humble opinion, okay, can get ratings or at least one thing for sure, no matter what happened, once Pearson's advertise with his show, his family's going to eat. The bottom line is, after all the talking, he's trying to get people to talk their business on the radio, they still go back to empty cupboards. They still go back to bills, pile up on top of bills, living with their families, some of them, after losing their homes. I ask the governor of the Bahamas, whenever you're ready, come and get a talented bohemian like Amos J. Miller Israel talented Bahamian to create the environment that tourists and others would be proud to see. Let's entertain the world. Mr. Christie and Mr. Ingram, your time is in Bahamian politics being up. You are the ages of my parents. You'll know nothing about the technologies that exist today in respect to science and technology. So, you are do not have, you all do not have the interests of Amos J. Miller Israel, an entrepreneur, a young Bahamian, business at heart. So I serve you guys. Notice, Steve McKinney is preying on the emotions of the people. He know what they want, the topics they want to talk about, and I agree. He does a great job at it. However, He's, set, he's trying to sell the WTO. And at the end of the day, the WTO also must remember and know that the Universal Declaration of Human Rights still exists. Corrupt leaders is what they need to cause their uh, wishes to be supersede, um, their wishes to supersede the wishes of sovereign nations and individual sovereign sovereigns of sovereign individual nations, smaller countries, smaller than themselves. The war, my friends, being over in my life because 
The world now knows that I am a world-class publisher of beautiful images speaking the truth. I have created these things simply to tell my story, my history. Come to find out, my story is the main story when it comes to the Sodis Islands, when it comes to certain esoteric-minded people, when it comes to black biblical history in the Bahamas, when it comes to politics in the Bahamas. Why? Did y'all betray the house of Willis Miller? Those of you who know what I'm talking about. The man serving World War II, y'all didn't even recognize him as a World War hero. So his children could have lived a better life. Thus, Amos would have had a better life by now. And my son, providing he was things to keep going, then, you know, we would have had a better life. Corruption, corrupt leaders, and corrupt political and religious leaders. That's how come our national debt is absolutely embarrassing for any government in the last 22 to 23 years to talk about. They talk very little about the national debt, yet they're trying to borrow and borrow money on top of money. We have a national immigration problem, a, a, a national emergency, okay, epidemic, whatever you call it, that is negative where we're having an influx of Ill illegal immigration and the government does very little to 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 uh, assist the fishermen in the Southeast Islands, so uh, with stipends to help, knowing what gas costs, but they don't want to help those brothers. And, and I blame the Minister of Fishing for this. He is a part, as far as I'm concerned, of a governmental conspiracy to defraud even the fishermen them owed good opportunity. They cannot justify eight. Uh, over five billion dollars being spent and borrowed, okay, in total, all the money that has been squandered, and young men are running from the islands, getting themselves to Nassau, looking for work that will they will never find, with hopes to find work in Nassau that they will never find. It is absolutely egregious. For Christ, I live, and for Christ, I die. I rather be a slave. In my grave, all right, than to be a slave, okay, all over again in 2013. You see, the natural resources of this country is owned by the people. The people's eyes are now opened, open to their own individual talent, okay? One man's garbage is another man's treasure, all right? Never look down on your humble beginning. Let us use everything and recycle everything. Companies, major corporations that are responsible for, in my humble opinion, dirtying up our planet with whatever it is, then let me be a lobbyist against it. And I trust those who understand the language of dynamis and the true nature of the truth will understand this talent is now declared by the boy you all tried everything in your book government of the bahamas to keep him uneducated so he will definitely not know how to speak like this 43 years after his birth why is that important because for 16 years before my birth the royal house of windsor would also today and on the 2nd of june 2013 celebrated 60 years of reigning sovereign. Well, guess what? 43 years ago, that would be a difference of 37 years as it relates to me and her. Okay? 37 years ago, I born as it relates to her reign. All right? So that's what it's about with their house. For 16 years, she reigned as reigning sovereign over the entire Commonwealth. Her house. Over major Eden. Garden over the major Eden of God. All right? And by the way, wherever the people of God is and willing to speak the truth and keep his word, they are the living ark of his covenant. So no matter where the physical ark of his covenant dwell, God dwell with the humble and the lowly. Blessed is the peacemakers. And I come in the name of the Yeshua to bring peace. And I'll do whatever it takes to get this message 